Welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to another video. So if you are new here, feel most welcomed. And if you're a returning subscriber, thank you so much for coming back to watch my content and to my premier gang. I hope you all are doing well. Thank you for tuning in, guys. So uh, guys, on this video, we are going to uh, clean up the kitchen. But first, we are starting by making dinner. Yeah, this was in the evening. So we are making uh, some fish with cabbage and ugali. So for the ingredients of the fish, I'm using um, a little bit of black pepper, tomato paste, uh, fish masala. Then I have the the green uh, hoho plus onions, some dania, some um, garlic and tomatoes. Yeah, then we're also going to use milk. So it is a very simple recipe, not complicated. You can try it and tell me how yours will turn out. Yeah. Seeing eyes of mine, you see, there are no trees inside of me. In this sense that I can look at you with love. And I will grow food is ready as you can see the slappage on this one uh 10 over 10 10 over 10 but tell me if you think it's a 10 over 10 so it was so yummy i'm not used to taking fish with cabbage but i didn't get cabbage nini skuma that's why we did with the cabbage yeah so this is the next day in the morning i didn't do the dishes at night because i was tired and i need to sleep early i wake up very early in the morning to prepare my girl to go to school so we are going to start by refilling the the soap caddy i had run out of the liquid soap so we are going to refill then we'll start cleaning the dishes then afterwards we measure on the countertops and some areas of the kitchen The seasons come and go like thoughts of you Like a wave returns to the sea into the blue and They change but in a cycle that I can't lose Each painful but delightful to live through Just like another season Not for long, just a time Just like another season Maybe this time next year you'll reappear For no reason But I'll cherish every day Until you come my way this season So guys, as you're watching this, I would love to know 
which is your what's your best chore in the house like what do you love doing in the house i know some people like mopping the people who like doing the dishes the people who like washing clothes or maybe cleaning so you can tell me that in the comment section for me <clears throat> i enjoy nowadays i think i enjoy cleaning like uh, just wiping surfaces not dishes in particular yeah i mean maybe tidying up the living room making everything look nice i used to love washing clothes but in nowadays the back pains are just too much it's no longer exciting but still we need to have a clean space it's really good like when you're in a clean space you just feel okay and it's more healthy so tell me in the comment section what's your favorite show in the house The seasons turn and change just like your mind Like the sun gives in to the moon and to the night Time continues marching it slowly crawls With each new one starting I recall Just like another season Not for long, just a time Just like another season Maybe this time next year you'll read me For no reason But I'll cherish every day Until you come my way this season So a few people, some of my subscribers have been asking about a review on these pots and also how to clean them. But I will drop a video on that very soon. Actually, I'm also I'm also looking for a way to clean them. As you can see, like the the one on top of the sink is stained. So I'm also looking for a remedy on that. But I will drop a video for you guys very soon. I will tell you what it's what they've how they've been serving me yeah have been serving me like kama zikopoa it's a yay or a nay so stay tuned for that yeah Like a never fading whisper in the breeze Oh, we will keep on changing All over again Yeah, we will keep on changing Just like another season The one another day With all you by my side All this season Next, we move to the cabinet area yeah so i am going to remove uh the utensils from up there and all the other everything that is up there then we'll wipe down the cabinets afterwards wipe the um, utensils then arrange them back so i'm using the magni all-purpose cleaner actually i've never used this cleaner this was the first time and the smell oh the smell is really nice i will always plug you on some good cleaners you know actually the ones that i've used so this one is a plus it's a plus so you can buy it if you want and magni is so affordable actually this one was 224 to me for a cleaner that is just okay yeah so that's what we are going to use to wipe down the cabinets and then we'll arrange uh, all the utensils that i have decluttered from that place <laughs> On this side you can see some insects there 
hizo zimekufa i had sprayed uh, some insecticides up there and it's working but what i don't like about this is that i've used it for a while i spray zinaisha for like one week then afterwards zinarudi tena so i think the best thing to do is just to fumigate the whole house to be sure that they are all gone and um looking forward to do that like really soon i already have um uh someone plugged me on a person who can fumigate the house for me and that is angel ndegwa she's also a youtuber you can check out her channel so her house was fumigated and it worked so i think i'll use the same person that fumigated for her because man i'm so tired with these um insects especially the cockroaches it's just too much i hate them and yeah i will do that real soon and we'll do a video on that <laughs> I'm also going to wipe the spice jars and I will use uh the same same cleaner that is the Magni <clears throat> the Magni all purpose cleaner afterwards we'll go ahead and arrange them I need to do some uh shopping as you can see some of my jars are uh, almost empty but we'll do that on another vlog then i'm also planning to add some jars the problem is the storage area but i will see if i can add some shelves in the in the in the kitchen to uh, get some storage space i'm still thinking about that because again where i stay our landlord doesn't like it if you uh, put things on her walls so i will think about that yeah and see what to do because i need some space then next i'm going to um declutter these baskets you see here i got these uh baskets from china square and they're serving me well they are really nice actually they have kind of beautify my um my cabinets i like them yeah so we're going to have them then in these baskets is where i keep my extra spices i keep some uh cereals also inclusive of indomie and some spaghetti yeah so this has really helped because this kitchen doesn't have a lot of space as you all know and yeah so i need to figure out on how to get some space before i get the storage jars done with that area so we move to this stand actually i need to spray paint this stand again like it's freaking out and it's no longer white the way i 
I want it to be so we'll do that like really soon so I'm going to wipe this area use the same same cleaner I think this is the only cleaner I used in the entire kitchen that is because it was really nice and it left my uh, kitchen smelling really nice so over here I also keep as uh, I also have some storage just there you can see here I have some salt I have baking powder I have uh the popcorn um the pop popcorn what popcorn maize then i also keep my silicone spoons there unfortunately i broke one of my oil jars particularly the one that carries oil and that got me so mad it was an accident when i say i broke i didn't like Come on, I didn't do it. Come on, I do it. it was an accident. So I'm thinking of getting another jar. Actually, not this one, a different one. But again, I'm also seeing that if I get a different from different one from this one that I have, they'll be kind of off in the picture. But I will see what to do with that. So cleaning in the kitchen can never be done without uh, tackling uh, the cooker. Actually, I think this is the my my this is my best uh, gadget in the kitchen. Like when it comes to cleaning, I enjoy cleaning the cooker more than any other appliance in the kitchen. Yeah. So the same same cleaner I used to scrub on top with some soap. Then we'll go ahead and use the Astonish a kitchen cleaner. Uh, to give it a nice shiny look and I did a thorough cleaning here also use a steel wool because there were uh, some things that were stuck on it and I really don't like it when my cleaner is kind of stained <laughs> So again, one of uh, these grills, is it a grill or what? That kachuma, ilivunjika, um, a sufuria fell on it and it broke. So I need to take that. I don't know if it can be repaired at the mechanic, but I'll see if I can take it. Not at the mechanic, at the welding people. Yeah, those people do welding, but I will take it and see if they can do something on it. So we move on to um, this uh, stand. This was actually in the bedroom if you know so right now it's a storage area in my kitchen 
this stand has really rotated in my house but anyway it's still okay so down there we have that kiondo i got that from my mom in love that is my mom in law so i use it to store some uh few things inside that is some extra cereals and yeah so i also clean that area then i have uh that hotel that i got from the market it went for 200 bob yeah so if you have a kendo you know you can't put it uh chini to get water like it had because that's why i also moved uh this stand over here i actually have another storage place for my baby's clothes so that's why this is in the kitchen and it has helped as a surface surface place like um uh, uh like a countertop you know i can put my things there i can roll my chapatis there so i don't want to say anything because if i do i might say the wrong words oh no so keep my mouth shut and i listen afraid i lose you if i didn't tell we find what we're missing and compromise so I keep my show so my so guys i need a plug from you i need a plug from you my people like which is the best microwave to buy because the one that i have is faulty right now it doesn't warm food you know you in anguruma to apple now nah, it doesn't warm food so i want to get another one and i need a plug from you guys which is the best one to buy i don't want to make any mistakes because this microwave is a maker is a maker make now hi i bought it last year it's not even two years old and it has started its shenanigans so i just don't want it i just don't want it and i niki angalia tu nakasirika so I need to I need to see what to do if I'll get a new one and so just plug me on the best one to buy please please so you can imagine the stress of wanting to warm food and kill us you go back to the uh, the cooking pots that one kwanza vyombo zinachafuka like a lot so I just need to get another one or make this one for the meantime like take it to the fundi I use it for the meantime but my I'm no longer attached to it. Imenibo to yeah. So that make no, 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 no. If you are going to suggest, please don't suggest Mika, because this one it's a no. It's a no. Would you stay with me Don't know what to do anymore. I'm mad at options, nothing's working. I'm out of service. I'm out of service. Come help me now, I'm fucking nervous. I'm, fucking nervous. I'm trying, but can't scratch the surface. Uh. So I keep my mouth shut and I listen. Afraid I lose you if I didn't. Can we find what we're missing and compromise? We are almost winding up with the cleaning over here. I want to sweep the kitchen first because kuna uchafu mingi sana on the floor. So we are going to sweep and then we go 
ahead finish with the mopping so i got this broom because the one i had it was short i had to bend and that one that one was not giving my back any vibes that's why i had to get this long one i got it at 320 bob actually it was just a random seller alikuwa natembea nazo so yeah i decided to buy it and it's working really nice so after sweeping we are going to mop the entire kitchen that's why you see i'm moving everything that's from the cooker to the gas to the fridge like i want to mop the whole flow yeah To mop the floors, I'm um, using uh, the Rush uh, liquid soap. Uh, this one is actually a multi-purpose. You can use it for floors, for dishes. I bought it for dishes, but many bowl. Like I'm just, uh, it is just bored me. I don't like it anymore. So that's why I'm also using it for the floor to end uh, really quickly so that I can go back to my normal liquid soap. Yeah. Cause I feel so free now So guys, uh, as you can see, I'm already done and this is how the kitchen looks or turned out. Yeah. The dishes up there are all clean. So if you see these containers here, it means I don't have cereals in the fridge. Yeah. Then the spices here, up here, these are the storage compartments I got from the China Square Mall, Unicity Mall, sorry. Then don't mind this, I have some milk here that I'm supposed to store in the fridge. Then over here, I broke one of these jars. So I need to get another one. I'm planning to get a different one. Yeah, so for this side, that's the setup. My tea bags here. Then over here, I have some spices that I use, salt and everything that I use regular. Yeah. So everything is clean as you can see. Then on the side of the cooker, I have some leftover food here that I have not put in storage containers because we are going to have some for lunch. So this mat is thrifted. I got this from a thrift shop just where I stay and it's really nice. It's kind of sky blue. I love it. Then on this stand, if you've been here for a while, you know this stand has been in the bedroom. So right now it's in the kitchen. It has actually helped me store a few things. So here I have my flour, rice, uji flour. Down here I have this cute kiondo. 
I got this from my mom, my mom-in-law. Yeah, I have some things stored there, like some extra cereals. Yeah, then this is a hotel. Yeah. So this is also the place I store these cleaners. Yeah, so this has really helped. Like for storage, it is just okay so guys we've come to the end of the video if you watched up to this point thank you so much and uh, let's meet on the next one goodbye